Bozeman Health Deaconess has been in phase three of their reopening plan since June. But how has a rise in COVID-19 cases affected their operations? MTN's Gabby Krevit has an update of their phased reopening plan. The state of Montana confirmed over 100 new cases of COVID-19 as of Friday afternoon, setting a new single day record for the state. And while we continue to see cases on the rise here in Gallatin County, Bozeman Health Deaconess Hospital says now is not the time to start reducing operational capacity in the hospital like in early months of the pandemic. Right now we do not have any plans for rephasing or going back in our phases. That means Bozeman Health Deaconess Hospital will remain in phase three, working at full capacity since June 1st. Incident Command with Bozeman Health says it's not so much the number of cases that will trigger a rephasing plan, it's the number of hospitalizations. Most of the recommendations that we have reviewed really surround our capacity to care for inpatients. Bozeman Health has 86 licensed beds at Deaconess Hospital and eight at Big Sky Medical Center. So if they start to see more hospitalizations, they have a plan. We have surge plans that are in place and those surge plans allow us to go up to 145 beds. And that's when we'd likely see the hospital rephasing. We would need to start reducing services elsewhere. And if we do get into that inpatient surge, we will have to relocate staff from um, other locations in the facility to be able to staff uh, additional locations in the hospitals. In the meantime, you can still make an appointment to visit your provider, but there may be situations where telehealth medicine is recommended even when the hospital's operating at full capacity. Really the only way to know which type of visit is, um, is recommended, they should call their provider office to, to determine that. In Bozeman, Gabby Krevit, MTN News.